Hi, everybody. It's your favorite one-man show. Um, yeah, I got some boxes again. I always do. So, um, let's go ahead and open these up and see what we got today. This one comes all the way from West Alice, Wisconsin. All right. Wisconsin took a long time to get here. Don't you know? So we quickly cut through it. It's packed all right. It's got bubbles. Let's see, that's not in bad shape. Press, uh, I'd say that's about 90%, actually. I've been waiting for this. Manny Faces. Manny Faces. And this is the retro Manny Faces, not the, the mini comic Manny Faces. Um, so there's actually two, and both of them are pretty cool. Manny Faces is the only one where I like the mini comic version. I don't like mini comic Triclops. I don't like mini-comic Stratos, for sure. And I don't like mini-comic uh, Trapjaw. But mini-comic Manny Faces isn't too bad. It's just his colors are just barely different. I think where he's blue on this one, he's purple. And where he's um, uh, that orangey color, it's a little less orange and a little more flesh-toned. But not a whole lot different. But, you know, he still has the ability to change his face. Yeah. Turn head for three different faces. All right. Unpunched. And there's the card is mostly sharp. You know, you can tell it's been handled a little bit. You know, when you compare it. But it's not really tore up or anything. So, let's set a bent corner. And we fixed it. All right, Manny Faces. And yesterday I got this in the mail. My Eternian Palace Guard. I don't know why these were so marked up. I, a lot of places where you find these are like $90. But I got this one for like 27 so 25 27 something like that. A big bad toy store. When in doubt, look at the big bad toy store. now we have a brand new box which I should be using these boxes up all the time shipping put that down there now this this is a box from the big bad toy store again it had a figure that everybody else charges a lot for um, but they don't this one particular item everywhere you see it it's in the high 40s to $50 and if you get it at the right time right right now maybe Big Bad Toy Store has it for 30 30 something oh wait there's two things in here oh wait what is why are there two toys in here Oh, okay. This came from, uh, this is my, this isn't actually from the Big Bad Toy Store. This is from a reseller who I traded with on, on Facebook. He just used a box from the Big Bad Toy Store. Let me see. Is, this, is it from Lenny? From Lenny? Yep, it's from Lenny. Yeah, right. I met this guy on the, uh, on a Facebook group that I'm part of. One of the Masters of the Universe Facebook groups. And um, after we talked for a while, we decided we trusted each other enough to mail figures. I think, I think he packaged his a little better than I packaged mine. <laughs> he put a lot of 
So I'm still waiting for one package from the Big Bad Toy Store. I don't know when it's going to get here, but it should be my Skeleton Warriors. Here is a punched, no, an unpunched. It just almost fell out. Unpunched, sharp, sharp, sharp faker. Faker. He's a, uh, if you're, if you look hard enough, you can find him for like 30 five to thirty eight dollars maybe even almost forty but a lot of places charge fifty and up for him I don't know why he's not terribly hard to get but uh, this is just one I wanted to have to open uh, and let's see what else we got in the box this is my prize my prize the bowl wrap on which is something you guys know I don't really like but it's uh it's acceptable I guess if um if you're trading two extra figures that you have for one figure you can't get cheap cheap enough this figure Grizzlor. Now I have Grizzlor. I've got Mantena. Uh, somewhere over here I've got uh, Leech. And now I have Grizzlor. And I have uh, Horde Trooper. And uh, somewhere over there against the wall I've got Hordak. The Grizzlor, the back of the Grizzlor, that looks like, it, it's kind of what they do when they do the mail-aways figures. Any of the figures you had to mail away for would come with a back that looks like this, with a all-over picture, instead of other figures on it for sale. But uh, this Grizzlor, is, uh, he said it was in, <laughs> when we were talking, he's like, I got a Grizzlor, but it's on a chewed-up card. <clears throat> and I said, well, I'm not interested in that. And then he shows me a picture, and he, this was his idea of chewed up. I mean, look at that. It's well taken care of, actually. See? So, um, yeah. Mystic Grease lore. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. That's the, uh, that's it for this video. If you want to, um, email me suggestions for figure reviews because I have a bunch that I haven't reviewed um, I have a lot to choose from just about all the figures except for ones like Koldar and uh, Duplico and the Snake Men um, or the Turtles I don't want to be the Turtles either I'm not buying the Turtles of Grayskull I do not like them um, yeah so use this email address boop, 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 right there and um, yeah thank you for watching like subscribe hit the bell leave a comment it really helps, you know, it really helps out. Everybody says that. I have to, have to say it religiously because uh, for some reason it's like people seem like they won't do it unless you, unless you remind them while they're watching. But anyway, thanks for watching, everybody.